Hey, Jenny Jones here, Digital Growth Hacks Club. Hey, listen, got another tool I wanted to put in front of you. Um, if this is your first time to this channel, please go ahead and like and subscribe. I'm always releasing uh, different types of tools and show you how to uh, hack them and try to get good growth out of your business and your business models that you may have. Um, so listen, I have a tool here I want to put in front of you. It's not new. It's been out for a while. I've been wanting to do a quick course on it, actually a quick um, video on it. Uh, it's mini course generator. It's what it's called. Um, they do have a lifetime deal that's going on right now. You can probably find a link to that description in there, but it's this tool, but I want to combine it with another tool. I actually want to combine it with three different tools. I'm going to try to get this um, through as fast as I can. Now, this is an idea. This is a hack. You can definitely use it. Uh, I do have another full course on how I did it um, step by step, but this is just a um, high level overview. So what mini course is and what you could probably use it for is I like to call it the new generation or maybe um, lead magnets 2.0, right? And so when we do lead magnets, uh, the traditional lead magnets is someone comes to your website, they leave a form or something like that. You have them fill it out and you can send them an ebook or something like that. This is a new, um, like I said, uh, a new way of doing lead magnets where you're kind of teaching somebody something. And, and what I did here is it's only three screens and I'm going to show you what the three screens are, but you can design either one of these. You can design a screen that has an info quiz, uh, open-ended or survey and a gateway that connects to a Stripe or PayPal. Now, these are, this is just a mini course. It's not a full blown LMS learning management system, but it's, if you want to teach somebody something in a quick, uh, scenario. So let me kind of tell you what I did with this one. And the way you do it is you just add a card here. You can just add a card. You can say, Hey, I want to add, um, I don't know, info card. And then you can just put the information there. You can put a link there. You can put a picture there and so on and so forth. Or you can just make it into a quiz and it'll ask you what kind of quiz single or multiple or something of that nature. So I just kind of did that here. I'm going to delete this and I'm gonna go back. That's all it really is to this tool. Um, they do have, you can do your domains and so on and so forth. But what I did with this tool, because again, I don't want to hold you long is what I did with this tool is I combined it with another tool uh, that I talked about and I have a link to that. You'll probably see it up top, but I combined it with Eureka. And what I did in Eureka is I went in that tool. I found out, is there any life insurance courses out there because life insurance um, I used to be licensed in it. I know it like the back of my hand and I have it as part of my financial module that I'm teaching people. I'm using this small course to introduce them to a larger LMS course that I have on the back end. And I'm gonna try to show you some components with it. This is a LMS learning hack using three different tools. So this is what I did. I, I put a video right here. So let's look at it. Let's see how it looks in a preview. All right, and so what I did here was I created a, um, you you probably can't hear it here, but what I did was I went and I did a um, an overview of life insurance, and I'm only introducing people, I'm, I'm just kind of wetting their appetite with what it is that I wanna show them and what I wanna share with them. And so what it does is just goes through the video, plays a little short story, talks about life insurance, how important it is, and. And um, even though I don't sell life insurance anymore, I still sell material and information around it. And so what I did here is this is more for name recognition or I'm driving them for a call to action and for allow them to learn more at my website where I have other tools that I wanna sell. But when they go there, they can have an opportunity. Um, well, let me talk to you, let me tell you what I did here is I went back and I says, hey, I'm letting you know it's a three minute session, just take a look at it. Then you hit next here. Then I asked them one question, right? And it says, hey, how long does life insurance last? It lasts forever, it lasts for two years. This is term life. It lasts for however long the term is. That's the answer to the question. I click it there. If they click any one of these other ones, they'll get it wrong. But they click there and they go on. And then so what you do is you take them, I then take them to a full LMS system. I'm not going to get into the details of that. I do have a link below on how I built out um, 
oh, it's my ebook series. I, how did I turn an ebook into uh, um, several hundred dollars in sales just from an ebook? And that's basically how I did it from here. Inside the ebook, I go inside and I embed some other things to take them to a larger, bigger course, which is more money. So I can make it free. I can take them from to five dollars. I can take them to fifteen. I can take them to twenty, and so on and so forth. But I explain that in my course I have below. You can pay for pay whatever you want for that particular course. I do have that below. Um, so this course, I end up selling it for $5 for this course, but how I convert an ebook, which is this course as an actual ebook and how I take it into a full blown learning management system that is available below as well. So this is a course that I would have set up for someone that says, Hey, get discounted course, right? And then use the life at the checkout. And then they, and so on and so forth. And so that's how they do this. But let me tell you what the research I did on it. Let me, let me, uh, let me show you using the other tool. And I do have a link for that video in here as well. So stand by, let me show you the tool that I used. Yeah. So, so this is the tool Eureka. This is the tool I was telling you about the other tool that I used. Um, and this particular tool, I just typed in life insurance and I wanted to see how many courses were out there. Most of these other courses here, these particular three are courses. There's really only three. When you look at these other ones, it's how they passed a life insurance exam. And this one talks about life insurance and a Facebook ad. So there's really only three courses that are out there on the top uh, eight platforms. There's only two platforms that have it. Uh, one is Allison and one is U Udemy. So there's not that much traffic on them. This is a free course that's out there. I've already looked at it. I think my course is comparable and probably even better. It's a free course, so obviously I downloaded it. And I and I think they're using this as a lead magnet, so it's free, so it has 14,000 students that was enrolled in it. If I did something close to this, my course is probably a little bit around the same amount of hours. If I did something like this and sold it in the same place, but had it for uh, and change the title a little bit, types of life insurance, and maybe raise the price, I don't know, five to seven bucks, I can probably do just as well as this particular course did. And um, it's telling me here, the opportunity score is 75, it says good, um, go super um, good ratios and trends. This is a tool called Eureka. I talked about that, I will leave a link in that as well, but this is, this is a tool where you can kind of research and look for different courses to write, um, look for different topics to write courses on. One of the other things they just added yesterday before I put the video out um, is they added, um, you can look for book research. So you can look for book research. What I put in here is one uh, I put in here for um, retirement plans. I did that one, I put that in there. Let me look up books for insurance. I wanted to. Um, and what it does is it goes out, it's a scraping tool that goes out and looks for different types of books. These are the types of books. There's 1,516 books. If I wanted to create an ebook or I wanted to create a book that I can then come back and put on um, um, Amazon or something like that, I can kind of see what it gives me. I can even go further. Um, and I can even look at some of the content of the book. When was this book produced? Um, I can look at some of the, the cover, the copy that it has, and it even has a link to the actual one of the books here as well. So again, this is a good research tool. I love this tool because it, it, if you are stuck and you don't have ideas, you, you can be all day trying to create stuff. I think a tool like this is a good research tool. So they just added this. And again, if you look at the video, you'll see where I did a full walkthrough of this particular tool. So go ahead and take a look at that when you get an opportunity. Again, this is Jenny Jones. Want to put out a quick video to help you. This is a good hack. Um, you can start out with the mini series and take them up to uh, the um, uh, uh, one of your LMS offerings. Um, a lot of people like things for free. You can, they, you can at least let them see your teaching style when it comes to using a mini course generator. I uh, should be a link down there as well for that one. Hope you're all doing well. Take care. Goodbye for now.